Kleinfelder is working on a transmission line project called the Lone Star Crez. And this project is a part of the Crez project, and Crez stands for Competitive Renewable Energy Zones. And this is one of the longest lines in Texas for the Crez projects. Kleinfelder teamed up with the owner and we performed a desktop study for the geologic conditions of the line alignments that the, they had several proposed alignments that they had to choose from. And Kleinfelder was involved as the owner's engineer and the geotechnical engineer of record to be to determine which routes would have been would be the best suited routes from a geologic and geotechnical standpoint. And so that's how Kleinfelder got involved in this project. Once the line alignment was finalized, Kleinfelder was hired as the geotechnical engineer of record. And like everyone knows that everything is bigger in Texas, and this line is also a very, very long line. When once completed in 2013, it will be approximately 325 miles long. When we started this project, it was in 2011, right before summer, and we had to drill approximately 450 borings, a total of approximately 18 to 20,000 feet of drilling. And in that extreme heat, Safety was a major concern. And we were drilling this project when the temperatures outside were somewhere in the range of 106 to 108 degrees. But fortunately, with our proper planning in Kleinfelder and are almost done with the geotech part of the project, and we have, we have zero injury so far. One of the main things that we had to deal with in this project was land access. And due to la land access issues, we had to, we had to mobilize our, our field crew quite a bit to access the boarding locations. The complexities were, it traveled through more than 100 geologic settings, which varied from very hard rock to sand to highly expensive clay soils. And the highly expensive clay soils is not very common throughout the country, and it's, it, but it's very common in the central Texas area. So that, that condition was quite unique when it came to the design, how it affected the design. And Kleinfelder had to make several design changes along the way that basically saved the client hundreds of thousands of dollars and also help maintain the project stay on schedule. With proper planning and mm, proper project execution, we added more scope to our initial scope and we, we designed the guy anchors for the angle structures that are used on this transmission line. And we performed the structural engineering on that and designed the guy anchors, and also later on we started, we were retained by the owner to perform the quality control inspections for the construction of all these guy anchors. In September of 2011, when Kleinfelder added the power delivery serv services group, Kleinfelder was hired by the owner directly to be the owner's engineer on this project. The role of Kleinfelder at that point was to provide assistance to the owner and overseeing all the engineering efforts in this project, which included overseeing all the engineering contractors that was involved in this project and provide supervision to all of them. With a very compressed schedule on this project, it was definitely challenging and it was definitely very rewarding that we could pull we could pool resources throughout the country, from all over the country, and we have 
approximately more than 200 people who has worked on this project so far. And that was possible because of the pool of the, of the resource pool that Kleinfelder has throughout the country. And so that was something very challenging and very heartwarming and very rewarding too at the same time.